pivot. P I V O T. One of the most important words in the English language. I don't know what it translates into into whatever language your native language is, but if you're an English speaking person, the word pivot has such a profound and deep unlimited meanings. But the most important one, you know, uh, I mean, it can have uh, uh, an actual physical meaning and it can have a uh, non-tangible meaning. You all know. Pivot is, imagine, imagine you're uh, flying on an airplane. I mean, as far as my uh, purpose of this video, imagine you're flying on an airplane, you're the pilot, you can make a minuscule a pivot in terms of your heading and in about 30 minutes one hour two hour five hour ten hour that will make a humongous difference in where you end up same thing with a car you know imagine your car is going down the highway you're going 80 miles per hour you turn the steering wheel just a little to the right you know if there is a road you will end up in a completely different place given a little uh, time and if there's no road, you go off the road and, and you die. Now, the same thing in pivot applies to life. Let's say you are pursuing a certain course of life. You're pursuing a certain set of actions. You're pursuing a certain set of behaviors and practices and habits that you have not changed for a long time. A small pivot, a small change in that uh, direction will make a giant mistake, um, a difference in your life given a little of time. It starts from the immediate time moment that you make that pivot, make that change, hopefully towards a correction, towards a uh, place that you want to end up. You know, a, a crude example, if as someone, let's say, spending their life uh, engaging in, in meaningless activities, playing video games, following sports, doing drugs and alcohol and no purpose in life and you make a small pivot one day something clicks in your head and you say I am not going to do this anymore I am going to start doing things that are going to have a direct impact on my life you know I'm not going to worry about which sports team wins because they're not going to share their winnings with me I'm not going to engage endless hours playing computer games because it numbs my brain, it, it damages the, the function of my hands eventually, and it serves absolutely 100% zero purpose in my life. It will not get me anywhere in life. That was an example. But use your own imagination. Making the right pivot. Hopefully you have a right mentor. You have a right life coach. You have the right person who the first discovers what you're good at then discovers what makes you happy and then shows you the road to pivot to to make it happen guaranteed guaranteed unless you come up with some disease and die guaranteed that pivot will make you end up where you want to be in life and you'll be so glad you made that pivot you'll be so glad you make that minor 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 pivot All it takes is a small move. Imagine that airplane. And just uh, if you've been in a cockpit of an airplane, which I've had the pleasure of being, as my friend is a, is a pilot and allows me to stay in the cockpit throughout the flight, there's a gauge right in the center that's a heading. Just one, you know, one click of a knob can make a world of a difference in where you end up. Wrong or right. It's all up to you. What are you going to pivot to? All the best.